And here we have it, ladies and gentlemen. One fully made daybed with the stupid dust on. It's done. It's ready for Davis to stay here tomorrow, our first guest. Guest. Yes, I know the walls are bright blue. You probably can't tell. They're very blue. No, we did not pick the color. And yes, we will probably change them someday. Here's a dresser. It's empty for guest use. Um, at the moment, there's towels and sheets on top because, well, because this is what the closet looks like and the shelves aren't in yet. But if you like to continue on the house, I know some of you are a little disappointed that there's no pictures yet, but I believe my camera cord's in here somewhere. So, could be a little while until we find it. This is the craft room, but for the moment everything else just gets shoved in. But, um, I'd like to show you the craft room anyways. Here it is. In that corner will be my table and sewing machine. Matthew's sticker machine and plotter will be over here. And this was where their ceiling fan cord was. Thankfully we had Tenny to fix it. And I know, like I said, some of you are sad that there's no pictures. Now here's what I'd like you to do to remedy that. Go ahead and press the pause button and then take a screenshot of your computer and there you have it. There's a picture of our house. Here we enter our master bedroom. Still a mess, there are boxes. That's my clothes, stuff from our nightstand more clothes. Here is our new hamper. It's pretty cool. We got a little matching one over here for Matthew's work clothes. The infamous closet door mirror. Mm -hmm. and those of you who knew Claire McNeely, yes. Yes, that is her nightstand. Claire Coney, formerly Claire McNeely. And there's my hairbrush. Those of you who follow me on Twitter know I've been looking for that. So, that is one exciting thing. Now I know Matthew stole it. Here's our closet at the moment, no doors, um, but a lot of my clothes are hung, it's about 90%, and some Matthews, there's a little bit of a difference, I know, and our master bathroom back here, it's still messy, but it's, it's a bathroom, so, I mean, we haven't been using it, but it's here, just in case we want to, is there any fixture we need to put up, toilet, shower, with the doors inside, but look at how well Lindsay cleaned it. It is amazing. And back to the bedroom. This right here, this is a light for our ceiling fan. And if you press this button, lights off. Lights on. Fan on. Full power. Fan off. Yeah. I'm a big fan of this. And it has a little clippy thing. But it's going to go in the wall. So we don't lose it. Okay, onward. I know some of you are getting bored. Dad, thanks for sticking with me. Here's paint colors we're thinking about. We're not leaving it pink. Here we have a game closet and some miscellaneous toiletries at the moment. Some more stuff like that. If we go down the hall, this is the bathroom we have been using. Very dark. That's our new fixture that Matthew put in. Pretty snazzy and towel rack, and our shower, and bathtub, and piles of bathroom stuff. Yep, piles, I know. Here's some of Matthew's artwork on display, bowling pins and flames. Here's the living room, a little hard to see. Let's shed some light on that. Oh, there's some light. Okay, so there's our light, our, that looks outside, and Fireplace, TV, more Grey's Anatomy, Entertainment Center, we bought this rug for $25 at Lowe's yesterday. This will not be here permanently. Here's our rocking chair, Matthew's new tool set, and our book bookcases. We're currently looking for a coffee table for this room. And the room I don't want to show you, but I will, because I must. Our kitchen, which is still a disaster. Do you notice? All of the doors. Still off. Mm -hmm. And our dining room. And yeah, that's a wrap. Oh, mom, this for you. I have a place for my eggs right there. And after I finish this video, I'm going to put them on the tree.